Hello guys and welcome to TechWolf. In this video I'm going to show you how to create a WordPress blog. And WordPress blog is a great tool for different purposes. For example, if you are interested in some subject to share news, to share different articles on that subject. So as 90% of people who are out there using WordPress blogs, not for the purpose of just sharing their news or sharing the things what they like, but they use it for making money. And one of the ways how you can use WordPress blog to make money is by using referral marketing and I will show you in one of my next videos how you can do it. Another way how you can use WordPress blogs for making money is by displaying ads on your blogs and that I will also talk about in one of my next videos when I will create a video how to make money from your website. Whether you are using your, your WordPress blog which we will create in this video, whether you are using your website or you have your own website for your brand or your business or for your product selling. So let's go guys and by the way guys third way is by product selling. You can also use WordPress blogs to sell different products and this is more efficient way than Instagram for selling products and services online. Instagram is not providing you so many capabilities rather than your blog or your website when you are creating your blog or website and if you are able to gain traffic and if you optimize your blog or you optimize your website to gain traffic to your pages and it is also fairly simply to do by using SEO or search engine optimization which I will also show in one of my future videos and by the way guys if you are new to my channel subscribe and help TechWolf grow and let's build this community together and in my videos I'm creating different stuff guys how to make money how to promote your business how to do trading how to create websites and many more things and many more useful stuff will be available on this TechWolf channel let's get into it and I will create new open a new incognito window I'm already using in my environment my blog which I already have created so it would open under my existing email address and here we will type in wordpress.com once you are here on wordpress.com you should also know about wordpress is that you should know that there are two wordpresses there is wordpress.com and there is wordpress.org and wordpress.org is for professional website building if you are going to set up your server and if you are going to build a website on your local environment and then you are going to send that website on some hosting then you would use not wordpress.com but you would use wordpress.org because that gives you full access to the files and full access of the code of wordpress but with wordpress.com it is a great way how you can build blogs and you can do it for free and I will show you how to do it in this video because they are prompting you in many ways to make money and to charge from you monthly fees but if you are newbie and if you are new to this you will not be able to do it for free because you will get somewhere catched by WordPress and you will start making payments for example for domain name or for hosting or for using this platform let's click start your website and we can start building and here you give your email address I will give my email address which I have created for purpose of this video techwolf at gmail.com and here you give your username I will type in make money oh sorry it has to be in together make money tech you can give it whatever username you want but whenever you are creating a username always try to make sure that your username makes sense and it is a good username because guys when you will create your wordpress blog and you will be posting posts they will also appear on wordpress read there is such a wordpress read where other people who are community of wordpress bloggers they can read those blogs and they will also be able to see you and they will be also able to follow you if your name doesn't make sense or it is bad name guys think yourself that nobody will even want to follow you if you will create username here which doesn't make sense then let's select our password create your account here you can select whether you want to create a blog business professional or online store but in this video we will be creating a blog not online store or professional or business however if you are planning to create a WordPress store or WordPress online shop I would not recommend you to use this platform this platform doesn't give you to full access or full capabilities of using WordPress I would recommend you to hire some web developer and create WordPress website from 
scratch. Then you would have a full access of editing that website, accessing code of that website and implementing different features in that website which you will to implement in that website. But WordPress.com it is just for basic bloggers and for basic usage and it will like I said it will be prompting you to for different charges monthly charges you will be paying for domain and for their hosting which is unnecessary you can get it for free here as I will show you in this video. So here we have blog and let's go with blog and you can change all these features which were there like business and so on and so forth later on guys and what is your blog about select category I will say blog what is your blog about you can add here your your blog name and I will add my blog name make uh, money online you can add whatever name you want here on this page you also see how your blog will look on mobile device as you can see here right hand side and you can see how it will look on desktop these are articles and this is content which you can change and many more things guys click continue once you are done here and then tell us your blog name and here make money online online this will be our blog name and then we click continue is the thing guys that it will be say, telling you already own a domain if you owe a domain like I said guys don't transfer to this platform you create your own website and do it from the very beginning right? and on my channel I already have created some tutorials where I'm showing you how you can set up WordPress website and that is available on my channel's homepage if you go to my channel here you at the very bottom of you will find the playlist web development and programming and there I have how you can set up XAMPP server and how you can create a WordPress website by using that wordpress.org and it is fair simple and you will also get a free website only you only difference is that you will need to host it on some hosting provider like hostgator but you will have access full access to the code of that website whatever happens in future where here if you will start paying guys you will not have access but you will be tied up to these payments every single month where you will have to pay every single month so that is just my recommendation for you guys who has no experience in web development I am developing and I am a programmer already for 18 years so you I know these systems inside out already own a domain no so here I will type uh, in you type in what would be the closest what you would want your website to be named make money online free I will type okay and let's have a look what it offers and here at the very top you will see two options like which are absolutely free it will be prompting you to buy all these with extensions dot nets dot coms and all and so on and so forth don't go for these paid versions then if you in future will decide to create your own blog you will need to transfer dns or domain name servers to your hosting when you will decide to do it so here by using this wordpress.com platform go free absolutely free no don't pay for any here you can see we have make money online free dot design dot dot blog this is okay for me so I click select here are these plans which I was talking they will be on every step first steps where they are prompting and want you to tie up you as a user who has no experience with making you to push his domain name and here is the second step where they want to tie you up to them guys to their plans by these plans like personal plan premium business and e-commerce and many of new people who don't have experience in all these things they would go with one of these plans because they would think that they don't have any other option to skip this you see not sure start with free site and here at the top you just click this start with free site and here you go guys we have just created a wordpress blog and absolutely for free not paying for any domains and it is available online now let's start editing our blog or our website or create our website or our blog website and here once you are in this page this is not your administration area of your blog this is your administration area for your account to edit your website you are not doing it from this administration area to get into website administration area you can see here on the left hand side VP admin just click on this button and it will open a new tab WordPress administration admin area from where you can edit your website and on this page you will be doing all edits of your website 
website say whatever you will want to do whether you will want to create new pages whether you want to create new posts whether you will want to add navigation to your website everything you do here and this is how wordpress administration looks it is a little bit different from wordpress.org administration but very similar here i will show you how you can access and how you preview how your website looks now so to do it you click here on my site you will get redirected back to that administration area which we just saw before we got here guys right and once we are here you will see here on the left top corner make money this home icon just click on this tab guys here you will see that you can edit your website kind of here but what will you will do here we will not be editing our website here you here see but here on the le uh, right top corner you see visit site just click on this red button visit site and this is how your website will look and here is dismissed because I, I, it is asking me to uh, confirm my email address I'm not doing it for now guys and this is how your website will be visible to all other people out there and here at the top you will see this black line or black black navigation guys but this will not be visible to all other people this is only visible to you as you are logged in and here in uh, url bar you see the address of your blog which you can share to anyone and your blog is posted and this is your blog url or unified resource locator or link people call it different ways but in general it is url unified resource locator on internet because that's how internet works pretty much guys so this is your website and you want to change it for example like I said to change it you will be doing it here for example if you would want to see all your pages here in your administration area you all your navigation is here on the left hand side uh, you click here in pages and you will see what pages are available there you have home page here and you have blog feed page and whenever I am working guys I have opened two tabs I have one tab opened where I am seeing the backend and I have another tab opened where I am seeing my website when I want to preview changes which I have pre done on my website I just come in and refresh it here and I, those changes will get added to my website for example I would want to create a navigation here okay and to do this we go back into our ad WordPress administration area and I will close this first up because we don't need it here I will need to go to appearance as you can see when I'm whenever I am hovering appearance or you can click into appearance and it will uh, open these themes customize widgets and menus we need to click into menu because we want to add a new menu and here we will add a menu and main menu name here menu structure menu name I will type in main underscore menu you can call it however you want it is just a menu name and as you can see currently I have two pages in this menu home and blog feed if I would want to remove any of these pages for example blog feed I would just need to click this small arrow and click this uh, remove but I'm not going to do it I will leave this menu here at the very bottom you see display location where you want to display this menu for example primary because we want to display at the top and in wordpress primary is always top menu guys and then second one is footer menu let's click on second one as well so we want to display this main menu on top and on footer and social links area menu we will not be displaying because that is another location for this particular theme where you can display menus it has three places it has primary footer and social links once you are done here and all your pages in future you which you will be adding will appear here and I will click create these pages in a second but after we have done this let's click save menu let's open our website and let's refresh now we have main menu which is at the top where we have home page which will always redirect user back to home and we have blog feed and here we are having blogs and we have only my first blog here if I click on it I will get it redirected into that blog but there is nothing currently and if we scroll at the very bottom you can see here is also home page and there is blog feed as you can see blog feed second uh, second page which which displays our blog posts guys now once we have done this and this is all time asking me to verify my email address I'm not going to do it for now now I will create more pages just to show you how you can create pages or remove pages if you are interested now we have how home and we have blog feed so we need to go back to our administration and for here find pages you can click into these pages 
and here once you will get redirected into these pages at the very top after pages you will see this button add new just click on it and let's create page for example about okay add new and this is because of my recording device it is taking a little bit more time and here it allows me to select different uh, looks of my page I will take a blank page okay this is just a layout of the page and use blank layout and here I will say about okay so this will be about page and here is in text area I can add here is some con or whatever you can write whatever you want if you would want to add image here on the left uh, top corner you can see this plus sign add block these are different blocks which you can add in WordPress like for example paragraph image or for example gallery and there is many more blocks which you can choose in here guys but we will be adding image so click on that and then click upload and then select image from your computer I will select this image I will add it and once you are done just click publish and publish and we have created about page once you you can click here on view page if you would want to view this page but currently you can see that this page hasn't been added to the top navigation but we want now to add we have home page and we would want to add about page as well here to be to appear at the top because if we go to home page or if we go to blog feed with or user don't have access to access this about page to do this we go back to our administration and to do this I click there on my site, I go into VP admin, actually I shouldn't be logging out from there and then we go back to appearance and we get into menus okay and here you will see that under pages we also have about page we click add to menu and here we can drag and drop where we want it to be located for example I want to be home and about page and let's another thing which I will show you straight away if you want to create drop downs let's create to about page a block feed to be a drop down of about page so drag it to slightly to the right and it will be as a drop down option for about page and let's save this menu now let's go back to our website let's refresh and you will see at the top we have home and about page and as a drop down on to about we have blog feed if we click on blog feed we will get to the blog feed there is my first blog here is our about page and now let's start by adding some posts for example we have created pages but pages from posts are different because we can categorize our posts we can add categories to different posts for example if we would be creating closing or talking about different closing subjects and then we could create for example different brands for adidas and we would create a category adidas and whenever we would be creating a post of adidas we would add it to category adidas let's create now post to do this we go back and here on the left hand side you will find this post also you can click it in or you can uh, hover it over and click on add new guys my post this is title and here as well add some text whatever you want my text to this post whatever you want to add and for example if we would want to add image we also will add image here upload and I will add this image to this blog post and I will publish it and next thing guys what I'm going to show you about these posts is how you can create different pages and on particular page to display some type of post for example you are posting some posts about cars you want to be some button here in navigation which says cars and you want to display posts only in about cars in that page or other page where you would want to create a post about Bitcoin this would be another category and you would want if person clicks on on Bitcoin button in navigation he opens only posts about Bitcoin but not about cars or any other categories which you are writing posts about so I will show you we will add another two buttons I will add the button cars and I will add the button Bitcoin but before we will create a post for it I will show you what you do so if we are back here is my post and I will say Bitcoin to this post okay you can call it however you want this is only for demonstration purposes and here in categories as you can see here on the right hand side make sure that this first one is click document so you will see here drop down categories categories opens you will see here add new category 
and I will add their category crypto. Okay, you can call that category however you want. We can call it to be the same Bitcoin, for example. Okay, it displays on Bitcoin page and add new category. So we have now Bitcoin and I will remove it from uncategorized so it is displayed only in Bitcoin. And straight away I will create another category, add new and I will call it cars. Cars, okay. And add new category. So we have here Bitcoin and cars, but I will uncheck this, uh, I will uncheck cars for this article. Okay, and I will update this. And once this is updated, I will click here on this left hand side top corner uh, arrow back. Okay, we will get to back to administration. As you can see, we are here now in the posts page and we added these two categories as you see Bitcoin. And the second hello world, as you see, categories entertainment and my first blog post, it doesn't have any categories. Let's go and, and this introduce yourself example post also done is uncategorized. So let's change these categories. Let's put this hello world. Let's click here, edit and also add it to category Bitcoin. Okay. As we are here, let's add it to Bitcoin and let's remove it from entertainment and let's update this and let's go back to our post page and we will do to second one my first blog post let's edit it and we will add it to category cars my first blog. We, we can change actually straight away this right editing whatever is here we should actually remove this block because I don't like such a huge block here I will remove it or it is just breaking the website and stick to the top of the block guys I will uncheck this here at the top so it's not being sticked and it is not displayed with bigger letters so guys I will uncheck and categorize and I will add it to cars and here, here I will change my first blog post to cars okay I will call it cars you can call it however you want let's update let's go back to our post and here I will close introduce yourself post example I will click edit this as well right it change title to uh, introduce cars whatever cars to introduce cars to and also I will check in categories uncategorized and I will check it to cars and I will update this blog post as well and now guys if you click here in into the title you will click there and it will open this blog post and uh, once this blog post opens you can see this tag under the title cars you just click on that tag, tag okay and you will find all blog posts related to this particular category on this page so what you need to do is here at the top straight after your domain name which is kind of make money online free dot design dot blog you will see forward slash and after that forward slash you take this url category and forward slash cars let's copy this and let's go back now into our administration okay to get into administration click my site and then we get back to vp admin we will go back into appearance and we will click into menus because we will be adding two more links and we will be adding custom links as you can see here custom links just click on it and delete this https protocol if it is on the way and here simply type in forward slash category forward slash cars and link text type there how you want it to be displayed on your navigation and add it to menu and I will add it straight after about page actually uh, actually it is already after about page and it will also be there and next one next link will be the same instead of cars we will add there Bitcoin because that is Bitcoin you can go and check it out the same way as I showed you how how I got this cars link Bitcoin okay and here I will type in Bitcoin to be displayed as navigation link and I will add it also here in navigation and I will save menu and when I will go back to my site will refresh this you will see two more links dismiss don't need this and now if I click in cars you can see that all cars articles are being displayed if I click into this article it will display on its own page guys and if we click on Bitcoin we see both articles which are in category Bitcoin so this is simple way how you can 
add categories and pages for for particular category where you can display only those posts or articles which are the, to that particular category as in this case for cars and for bitcoin and next thing and last thing what i will show you in this tutorial is how you can change look of your website in wordpress we use themes as you can see here on the top this dismiss all the time is appearing sorry for this guys i haven't verified my email but now i will show you last thing how you can change the look of your website and this is also fairly simple if you go back into your administration you will come here in appearance on the left hand side and in appearance you will see themes if you hover or you click on it it will open this drop down themes just click in themes guys and there will be different looks which you can change your website to if you go currently now yes this is your themes and if you want to change this look you just have to browse here for example we would want our website to look like this as you can see red hill then we would click there but i will have a look maybe something more interesting let's let's get this dark black seam and i will click activate and this will activate the seam and this is how our website will look, look now and customize your site we can customize that different options but actually i will not be doing it i just clicked there but there is different options how you can customize i will click it away so to close this simply and i will open my site now and i will refresh it and you will see a totally different look as you can see our site now looks like this we have about under about we have this blog feed then we have these cars at the top this still is breaking my website this uh, unverified email is breaking my website but here as you can see we have cars articles here if you want to see bitcoin articles it is here guys and this is how our website looks now so yes this is the way how you can create a wordpress blog guys play around with this administration there is tons of other features which you can use just play around but this is basic how you can create basically how you can create a wordpress blog and if you found this useful leave a like share this video subscribe to my channel if you are new and see you in the next one